welcome back it's our weekly check-in today is wednesday and we are going to restuff our wallet and unstuff it for last week and then for this week um i really think that the new way of doing things is working out fantastic we're gonna set this money over here for now and see what we have left in our wallet so in groceries we have two dollars left and i do already know where i'm going to put this money and i'm going to be showing you shortly in gas we have a 20 left pets is going to be rolled over and then paid our tractor supply card because that's what we buy our chicken feed and pet food so i'm just gonna leave that house is empty sports i did pull from my binder but i'm gonna leave it because we are starting with um basketball games and stuff now so actually no i'm gonna pull it and put it back with sports because i'm about to give um us some more sports money so we're just gonna sit this to the side though that's not going to challenges okay so how was your guys week did you stay on budget or not let me know let me know so we're gonna be stuffing 100 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 10, 20, 30, and $35. I stayed on budget. I don't think I went over on anything. Um, there were some things we didn't get because I'd already, you know, spent my money. But other than that, we did pretty good. Groceries is getting 110. And my dad killed... A deer and we just recently yesterday actually um, turned it all into ground beef and some tenderloin so probably we'll have a lot left over on groceries on my next unstuffing gas is getting 80 and we did really good on gas as well um, Friday is my kids last day of school and um, so my car won't be moving much at all. Just my husband will have to go to work and my kids don't go back till January 3rd. So we should be good on gas. Might have leftover in gas again too. Pets is getting another 20, which like I said, I'm gonna pull this and put this back in the bank to pay the card with. So I'm actually just gonna go ahead and sit this 40 here because that money is spent. House is getting five. Sports is getting 10. And then the kids, which isn't in here, I told you guys that goes in. Oh, we have change in there. That goes in my um, kids' lunch account, which is in my joy binder, which is back to school. I need to make one for just lunches, but for now, this works. And I will update trackers later we're not going to do that right now because i want to tell you guys about the new binder where we're going to be adding this stuff to but first we're going to pull out our change um change my kids took some change this morning so to school but there's a new little challenge that i'm going to roll over next year it's one of the only challenges i am rolling over let me grab it it is save those coins I have filled it up this much so far I have not shared this with you guys yet because I was debating on whether to start it now start it at the beginning of the year when I decided to just go ahead and start it and sorry if you can hear little birds in the back I have quail that are hatching out and they are in my kitchen and I am in my dining room but let's see we have 25 50 75, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, and 94 cents. So we can mark all the 94. Make sure it's all silver. It is. Get a solid marker. 94 is here. We are going to use a purple. 
and this challenge is on my Etsy. Um, so when you're done saving this, it would be 120.92, and I actually made one for my kids to do as well. And they're having fun. They like find pennies, and they'll like put them here, and when they get enough, they'll erase it and like keep going. But it's a really fun way for the kids to get involved as well. So left over, we have 20. $2. So this 20 is going to be going into my new binder. This is my monthly binder and my rollover money is going to fund this, I hope. So we're going to start with, go ahead and get started on January. And we have a 20. So we are going to go ahead and color in our snowman. Our snowman going to be a colorful snowman because I don't want to leave him white because how much fun is that? It's already white. So he's going to have a blue hat. And what do you guys think? A orange body because that's not realistic at all. Oh, it didn't really show up orange. I still need to get the permanent markers I was talking about. But I was at Dollar General and just saw these different colored ones and I knew I was going to start this challenge. So I really wanted to grab some. But $20 is our snowman. So we're going to add it over here to our challenge binder. So each one um, is $100. So at the end of the year we'll have $1,200 and then there's a little tracker but they're really cute i can't i'm so excited to get it started this money isn't going anywhere um yet i'm going to leave each one in here and it will either go to emergency fund or whatever needs to be done when it's in january of next year when we're done with this unless we finish it before that we finish it before that we will put it somewhere and then just re-pick back up maybe in the month that we're in and see how much more we can save so I don't have one for two dollars. So we will take our challenge binder and we're actually gonna be emptying this in the next video. I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do with that. We're gonna add the two dollars to rainy day. And we are gonna color in two little slots. But that is going to be it for today's unstuffing and restuffing of my wallet. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I hope that you guys were able to stay on your weekly or bi-weekly budget so far for the month of December. Until next video, which will be unstuffing that binder, which is not a lot of money. But we're going to put that money in some good places. And I will see you guys very soon. Bye!